Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, dimension two in the annotation tab here. Here is the dimension two that I'm going to talk here. So this is a smart dimension. I mean that it is smart because we can use it to the dimension different types, different types of shapes, like the line and uh, circle or the arc, etc. Uh, before start using the dimension 2, let's draw some drawing. So, uh, usually, I need to do a zoom extent, make sure that we can see the major grid and the minor grid. Also, it's good to activate the grid snap and activate the object snap here. Make sure that you select the end point, mid point, center, geometric center, and perpendicular, which I want to use and will have. And uh, also, notice that the snap setting, snap setting, snap uh, grid setting, here, uh, the grid spacing, x spacing, y spacing, 0 0.5, 0 0.5, major line, every 5. Okay, so let's draw a line first. I want to draw a line here, which is not exactly the same length. That's okay. Uh, let's dimension it. It's the dimension two. This is small dimension. So right now I want to switch off the grid snap. So that will help. I just want to move. I don't want to snap the grid. Right? I want to move the cursor on the line, on the line, move the cursor on the line. Right now, we see, and we click it, we drag it, we see the, we see the lines, we see the lines disappear. And uh, let's draw a triangle with the polyline too. And now I want to activate the snap mode here. Use the polyline tool. I want to start from here and go here and uh, go here and, and here. So this is a triangle. This is a triangle. Let's dimension it. Activate dimension two and just switch over the grid snap. Move on the cursor on the edge. Click it and then move move down. This edge. This edge. Okay. So if I want to dimension the height of this triangle, I will start from here. This is the center point, and then click the the top point here, and then drag this way. This is height. So let's draw a circle. I need to activate a grid snap, and it's a circle. Draw a circle. For the circle, I need to dimension the radius or the diameter. We use the dim dimension tool, so it will be automatically. We put on the circle, and now we give the here is the, here is the diameter for the default. So let's move up a little bit. Here is the arc. Let's draw an arc. So arc, here is the arc, the fourth point, second point, second point. And dimension it here and move the move the move the cursor, move the cursor on the on the arc. Now click it and drag drag it, we're going to see the leader, and then we we'll land the leader here. So this is going to be the radius r. Okay, let's keep doing the dimension. Let's use the pen tool, move to the left a little bit. I'm going to use I'm going to use the rectangle tool here, rectangle tool here, and then draw a rectangle. 
And then dimension it. Click the dimension two on the cursor on the edge. We see the lens and move it here. And uh, it is here. We have the lens, we have the, the width. And this is the ellipse. We need to draw it clearly for the ellipse. We need to decide the uh, the the long axis and the short axis. So here is the ellipse too. Here, let's decide the center. I need to decide the center first, and then I decide the long long axis here and the the short axis here. Dimension it. So here, because I already activated the object snap too, so when I move the cursor, I'm going to see the geometric center here. Let's put it here. I also, you see that there is a perpendicular point because I already activated the object snap to here. So I stop here and move it down. And to the dimension, another, the short, the short axis. Let's move to the center, click it, and move to the end of the axis here. And drag it to the right. So I have the long axis and the short axis. So this is a polygon. Polygon, let's draw it with the polygon 2 here. Here is the polygon 2. And uh, we need to decide, look at the command window, decide the number of the side. Right now I have a file side. This is a polygon. Decide the center, the center, and we decide it here. And uh, uh, first type in file. We need to type, still need to type in file. And then we need to decide the center. And then here, look at the command window. I want to decide what type of circle, right? I want to put in the in 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 the first option inscribed in the circle. Okay, select I. Now I put it here. I guess the draw needs to decide the radius. The radius I just stop it here. Dimension it activate dimension two. Put on the edge. I need to switch off the uh, grid snap. It is hard. If it is hard to put on the put on the edge, dimension it here. And I may want to dimension the the radius right from the center to the to the, to the corner, center to the corner. Okay, thank you very much for your watching.